Hello everyone, welcome to home, your 30 day yoga journey. It's day 23, focus. Let's get started. Welcome back, my darling friend. Let's begin in our comfortable seat. Right away, go ahead and close your eyes. Trust, trust this moment. Trust that this time that you're taking for yourself is valuable. We're gonna start to gently deepen the breath here. And your hands can rest gently on the thighs or the knees, but let the fingertips be kind of soft. Start to lift up through the heart, the sternum. Tuck the chin slightly and just take a moment here to land. Just a little loving reminder, whatever you're coming to the mat with here today, it's all good. It is accepted here, welcome here. The invitation today to focus or refocus back on your intention, your why, your reason for going on this journey. Remembering that we're not aspiring to transform into something that we're not, but rather return home to embody everything that we already are. Let's take a deep breath in together, you and I, but also Think of all of the people practicing together in this moment across the globe. It's pretty miraculous. Here we go. Take a deep breath in through the nose. And out through the mouth. Great, bat the eyelashes open. And we're gonna sit up nice and tall. We're gonna send the fingertips out in front, palms face down. Plug the shoulders in, inhale, exhale, draw the shoulder blades together and then imagine them melting down the back body. All right, from here, we're gonna take the left arm over the right, elbows cross, then send the fingertips up towards the sky. Cool moves, like a little ninja move, Haya. So we're gonna stay here if the shoulders are really tight or if we have any injury we're healing from, stay here. Otherwise, we're gonna keep wrapping around. Maybe right palm comes to the left palm. Maybe we just come here at the wrist, keep soft fingers, that's fine. So I'm wanting to keep my shoulders plugging in, shoulder blades kissing together and melting down the back body. Inhale to lift the elbows, long puppy belly here, big stretch and outer shoulder. Exhale, navel draws in, we round through chin to chest. So getting our spinal flexion here with some eagle arms to start, inhale. Think cow pose, lift up. Exhale, think cat pose, rounding through the spine. Inhale, lifts you up. Exhale, rounding forward. Inhale, lifts you up. Exhale, navel to spine, bow the head forward. Great, inhale, lifts you up, unravel. We're gonna send the fingertips forward, we're gonna go right into the other side. Here we go, right arm crosses over the left. We'll send the fingertips up. Then maybe we continue the journey around here, maybe not, maybe you just stay here in this nice, cool, like, aya pose. Here we go, spinal flexion, inhale, lift and lengthen. Exhale, rounding through. Inhale, to lift, lift up from the pelvic floor. Exhale, round through. Inhale, to lift. 
Exhale to round. Inhale to lift. Exhale to round. Inhale to lift. Unravel, exhale, float the palms to the knees or the tops of the thighs. Close your eyes and just notice how you feel. Beautiful. Inhale in, exhale to come forward onto all fours. Spread the fingertips, curl the toes under, send your gaze straight down. Inhale in, exhale, lift the knees, let them hover, hovering table, you got this. Low belly and upper abdominals, cinching in, drawing in towards the center of your being for three, two, and on the one, send the hips up high and back. Walk your hands forward, downward facing dog. Nice work. All right, get loose in the neck. Ground through the knuckles. Pedal it out, breathing deep. Remember why you committed to this journey. Inhale, bend the knees, carve a line with the nose to look forward. Exhale, make your way to the top of your mat. Nice forward fold. You decide, feet together or hip width apart. Just nice conscious footing. Take a deep breath in. Exhale to let something go. Then bend the knees, tuck the chin and slowly roll it up, nice and slow. Stand up nice and tall. We're gonna interlace the fingertips behind the tail here. Draw the knuckles down and away, open up through the chest. Big breath, big stretch. Inhale, lift your heart. Exhale, bend the knees, belly comes towards the tops of the thighs. Knuckles reach all the way up towards the sky here as we bow the head in. You can keep a generous or slight bend in the knees here. Breathe deep. Inhale to halfway lift. Knuckles go towards the back edge of the mat. Crown forward, of course. And then exhale to release everything. Forward fold. Great. Bend the knees. Plant the palms. Step one foot back, then the other. Feel free to lower to the knees here. Plank or half plank. Inhale to look forward. Shift forward. Squeeze the elbows in. Exhale to lower to the belly. Inhale, press into the tops of the feet. Heart lifts, we rise up, cobra. Exhale to soften and fold. Inhale to press up to plank or half plank. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale in. Exhale to empty it out. Bend your knees, inhale, draw your focus forward. Exhale to make your way to the top, have a little fun. Beautiful, inhale, halfway lift, your version. Exhale to soften and fold. Listen carefully, bend the knees, tuck the chin into the chest, roll it up, slowly stacking through the spine, one vertebra by vertebra. Crazy hair day for me. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Interlacing the fingertips behind, opposite thumb on top. So the one that feels a little strange. Connect to your energetic body, that lift through the front, that grounding through the back. Big breath, big lift up through the heart. Inhale, 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 exhale, bend the knees, send your heart forward, knuckles go all the way up towards the sky. Folding inward. Slight bend in the knees. Here we go, inhale, halfway lift, send the knuckles back, crown forward, straighten the legs. And exhale to let everything go. Plant the palms, step or hop it back, plank or half plank, and moving through a vinyasa, maybe belly to cobra, or maybe chaturanga to upward facing dog. Build a little heat, follow your breath. We'll meet in downward facing dog. In downward dog, inhale, lift the right leg up high. With your breath, exhale, shift it forward, squeeze the right knee all the way up into the chest, and then step it all the way up into your lunge. Keep this back knee lifted here. Bring your right hand over to meet your left and walk your right foot out just a bit. Inhale to look forward. Exhale to lower the back knee. 
Great. Inhale to reach the right fingertips forward, all the way up, and then take it all the way back. And we're just going to point towards that left foot. Point towards the left foot. Beautiful. Inhale, reach it all the way up, back to the sky. Right fingertips, reach, reach, reach. And then all the way back to frame your right foot and your nice low lunge. Here we go. Get light on the fingertips as you breathe in. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, plant the palms, lift the back knee, step it back. Belly to cobra or chaturanga to upward facing dog. Just building a little heat. We'll meet in downward facing dog. When you get there, inhale, lots of love in. Coming back to the breath, exhale, lots of love out. Inhale, lift your left leg up high. Exhale, shift it forward, squeezing that left knee up into the chest. Step it up into your lunge. Keep the back knee lifted if you can. Bring the left hand over towards the right. Send your focus out in front. Nice, long, beautiful neck here, so not clenched. Inhale in deeply. And exhale completely. Good. Lower the right knee. Here we go. Inhale. Send the left fingertips forward. Inhale. All the way up. Send it back. Keep breathing. We're just going to point towards that right foot, opening up through the chest. Beautiful. And then taking it all the way back. Really reach. Inhale. Left fingertips all the way up. Take up space. And all the way back down to frame the left foot. Get light on the fingertips. Inhale. Open the chest. Look forward. Exhale, plant the palms, lift the back knee, step it back, plank or half plank. Take a vinyasa here, belly to cobra or chaturanga to upward facing dog. Find what feels good. Meet me in downward facing dog. Meet Benji in downward facing dog. From here, bend the knees, inhale, look forward. Exhale, make your way to the top. Inhale, halfway lift your version. And exhale to soften and fold. Beautiful. Listen carefully. From here, bend the knees generously. Send those hip creases back, back, back. Yep, grounding through all four corners of the feet. We got this, Utkatasana. Send the fingertips forward, hips way back. Squeeze the legs together. Thumbs up, pinkies down. Shoulders are relaxed. Sink a little lower. You got this. Draw the low belly in and up. Send the hips back. Drop a little lower for three. Two, on the one, we rise together, reaching, reaching up towards the sky. Big breath. And then exhale, hands to heart center. Pause here. Close your eyes. Observe your breath. Always bringing the focus back to conscious breath. What an incredible tool. Alrighty, open your eyes, send your gaze out way beyond the horizon. If the feet are not together, really together, keep your gaze out as you bring them together. And then we'll find that lift as we breathe in. And we'll shift the weight to the left foot as we breathe out. Begin to peel your right heel up. So we're not collapsing the hip here. We're using all of our training thus far to maintain balance between left and right side of the body, even in these funny compromising shapes, which we're about to go into one. Here we go. Send the fingertips forward. Okay, keep this lift in the heart. Keep drawing the shoulders back. Here we go. We're gonna cross the right arm underneath the left. You can come to this shape here first. Maybe you just hold this shape, or maybe you continue the wrap around. Eagle arms, Garundasan. We're gonna inhale, lift the elbows. Exhale, bend your standing legs, sink deep. From here, you can keep your right toes on the ground or we'll imagine we're lifting up the right knee with the marionette string. So we're really keeping our centers kind of turned on here to lift, hey -oh. <laughs> lift the right knee all the way up and cross it over the left leg. Keep the left knee bent. It seems counter counterintuitive, but we're gonna hold on to this center, this balance, by keeping a strong bend in that standing leg. If you can wrap the right foot around, go for it, but it's not necessary. You can also use the right toes here as a little kickstand. All right, let's use our breath. Inhale, lift the elbows. Exhale, navel draws in, relax your shoulders, and find your focus. Find your drishti, a place in which you can focus your eyes and gaze upon and find your balance. If 
you fall, remember we're here to explore, to practice. Just come right back into it. Garundasana. Breathing deep, you're doing great. Welcome that heat. Then draw the navel in, find your center, begin to unravel. Inhale, we'll ground through both feet, lift the elbows up, then exhale all the way through cactus arms, open your chest, and then relax the fingertips down at your sides, mountain pose. Take a second here to just observe. Notice where your attention goes here. I feel like each week I have a gentle reminder to myself. Dear Adrian, remember where attention goes, energy flows. Where am I focusing my energy? What seeds? <laughs> What little buds am I watering this week? All right, sending the fingertips out. Bend the knees. Peel the left heel up. This time, left arm underneath the right. Find your version of the eagle arms here today. Strong focus. Calm breath. Shoulders relax down, elbows lift up. Now, imagine that little marionette string on your left knee. I love this image because it helps me remember that this movement is coming from center, from your core, from that middle. Here we go, inhale, lifting it up. Right knee stays bent as you exhale, cross the left leg over. Maybe you find your kickstand here, maybe we wrap. Keep that deep bend. Inhale, lift the elbows. Exhale, sink a little deeper, find your drishti, find your focus. Nice calm breath. If you fall, come back to it. Hold on to your grace. You're doing great. Take one more breath. Then we'll inhale, lift the heart, lift through the crown, ground through both feet, lift the elbows up, up, up. And exhale, unravel, cactus arms here, open up through your heart, your chest, fingertips. Slowly float down and we pause, observe. Notice how you feel. Inhale in. Exhale to open the eyes without looking down. Trust that ground is there. Trust me, trust yourself. Here we go, trust the practice. Just gonna step the feet wide, find soft bend in the knees, and here we go, knocking on heaven's door. This is how we're closing it out today. Feel the warmth on the back of your neck, the back of your spine from Eagle. Return to nice, full, buoyant, beautiful breaths here as you sway back and forth. You can get a little crazy here, you can Really pick up the pace. You can find a little float. All right, so I'm gonna invite you to think about this little reminder where attention goes, energy flows. So what do you wanna focus on for the rest of the day or the evening? What do you wanna focus on towards the rest of the week? And what should we focus on for the last beautiful leg of this journey here together. Slow it down until you finally come back to center stillness. Close your eyes and just give thanks for this moment. I love a good return to gratitude, right? Thank you. Draw the palms together. Walk the feet together. You don't need to look down here. We got this. Thumbs up to the third eye. Let's take one final breath in here together. Big inhale. And exhale to close the practice. 
Namaste.